Leg 5 is 380.58 kilometers and is set at 176.50 kilometers. However, for safety, the first half was cancelled and reduced to 89.62 kilometers. SS5 is set as a loop course that returns to the same hotel. This area is a rally course famous for its winding. In the past, this course was an open exhibition in the Asian Pacific Rally. Four rallies, it's a very famous place. It's like the same mountain route as SS2. Suddenly stacked rice fields and plantations emerging are a characteristic and the road has complications inserted into it. Because many cars got stuck, the back of the pack was stalling. To somehow resolve this, the dense grassy fields became a new route.
The free-for-all Moto Classy's top rider, Manon, finished top today. Also, the second place position went to champion, number one, Keske Maeda. Furthermore, the third ring went to number 11, Yoshio Ikemachi. And yesterday, the two drivers that submerged and received a big time loss. The two drivers that submerged and received a big time loss quickly returned to the top ranks. The Auto Class's Japanese driver finished in the top three today. Number 124, Ikuo Hanawa, jumped to the overall eighth rank. Instead of using a special rally modification and using the normal market's best car, he still competed with the top group's times. Finally, tomorrow is the 2015's conclusion and we're heading towards the final section. The Moto Class's top five have a crowd of about 15 minute differences. One miss can simply turn into a position change. It's turning into a large all-out battle. Leg six is returning 281.81 kilometers to the rally starting area of Tenma and SS6 is set at 45.18 kilometers. On the final SS, each rank starts from their current position. On the last day, in the past, a difficult navigation section was always prepared. A missed course resulted in a position change. Furthermore, the machines running at the top, with only 7 kilometers left, have crashed and have had to retire. So, until the very end, there can't be any feelings of relief. The Moto Class's fierce battle for victory. The top five have a 15 minute time difference. Furthermore, the top three are running together with only a five minute difference, so they can't be relieved. In Auto Class, number 101, Natapon, is running alone in the top position. As long as there is no big accident, there is no doubt that he will be victorious for the second consecutive year. Also, in second place is number 110, Kenjiro Shinozuka. He has manipulated the small Gemini with skillfulness and with an overwhelming experience. He fought with a high-powered diesel with magnificence. At the 25 kilometer mark, Number 105, Takuma Aoki, is stopped. His front suspension arm has broken and he can no longer run. Also, the Moto Class's 
fourth ranked number 20, Magnus Osterberg, on his last attack passed one vehicle. He went up one position to rank three. Moto Class's winner was number 11, Yoshio Ikemachi, who managed to hold on to his second place five minute gap to become a second time champion. Even though getting caught in a deep river and having a submerging accident, the reading of the complicated map and a high navigation skill helped make it through the rally. Second place went to Korea's endurance champion, number 17, Yu Nungo. He showed us an explosive speed in this difficult navigation battle. Now the curtain has closed on this 20th anniversary. The Asian Cross Country Rally began in 1996 with Thailand, Malaysia, Singapore, Laos, Vietnam, Cambodia, Myanmar, and many more. These countries began the rally and from the start until this year, it has developed into a very special event. In a rally, it's not a one-track thought. It's a complicated course 
that combines what can be thought. How can that course be clear? It's a rally that tried the machine, the driver, navigation, and teamwork. Next year, the preparation for the Cambodia's Angkor Wat route is highly anticipated. A rally's essence is, to have a tomorrow, try as hard as you can in today's contest. For those who have become obsessed with this kind of allure, next year, the rally will return once again.